Give each player a player board and put the teacher board in the middle of the play area. Then give each player some pieces. Each player places four great chips F side up on their freshman classes. Place the club deck, influence card deck, essay deck, and freshman event card deck like so. Then draw clubs equal to the number of players. In this case, you draw three clubs. Give each player two essay cards and four freshman event cards. They may look at these cards. Players will now draft their event cards. Look at your four event cards and select the card that you like the most. Then pass the other three cards to your right. A good rule of thumb for newer players is to select the card with the most action points, which is the number in the top left corner of each card. Players should continue drafting cards until they have four cards once again. It is important to note that in the two-player variant, players do not draft cards. Finally, each player places sliders on zero stress, 10 happiness, 10 integrity, and at 10 on the resume point track around the teacher board, since each integrity is worth one resume point. You are now ready to start playing. The start of each turn begins with a player selecting a card from their hand and playing it in front of them. The event immediately occurs. In this case, it gives Stan plus two stress. Stan now takes actions equal to the action point value on his event card, in this case three. The actions that each player can take are listed on each player board, as highlighted here. By placing action cubes on event cards and moving them to these squares, you can keep track of what actions you have taken so far. Stan studies, so he gets one stat. The four stats are English, Math, History, and Science. Stan decides to get a Math stat. Stan studies again to get a second Math stat. This is crucial because to correct his class to an A, he needs two Math stat, as listed in the left corner of the class. Now that he has two Math stat, he can take the Test Corrections action to correct his Math class to an A. Stan spends his two Math stats and flips his Great Chip over. Now that he has taken all three of his actions, he can remove his Tracker Cubes. Getting A's gives a player teacher influence and points. Getting straight A's gives a bonus. In this case, Stan gets one point, so he moves his tracker one up on the track, and he also gets three teacher influence with Matthew. The next player plays Halloween, and an influence card is drawn. When an influence card is drawn, it is revealed face up. A player can buy it on their turn for the cost, in this case, three happiness. Pry decides to buy it and loses three happiness. This does not cost an action. Pry also gets one English stat due to the effect of Halloween and decides to share this effect with Stan. Pry now gets three actions. She decides to chat with a teacher. This gives her two teacher influence per chat. Pry decides to put all six influence on Novel. If Pry gets 16 influence, she can buy a rec letter worth six resume points. She can also spend two teacher influence to gain one happiness. Pry chooses to do this and it does not cost an action. The next player plays Pacer Test and immediately gets four stress. They now have four actions to take. Norm chooses to socialize four times and gets a total of eight friends. Norm decides to take a look at the available clubs and sees that he can buy math team for eight friends. This will give him six math influence immediately and two math stat at the end of each year. It also gives him three points. He puts it in front of him and spends his eight friends. Norm can now move himself up three points on the track and also give himself six math influence. It is now Stan's turn again. Stan looks at his hand of event cards and decides to play Discover the Answer Key. This card causes him to flip top rolled history to an A, and also lose one integrity. When a player loses integrity, they lose the same number of resume points. Stan gets two points though for getting an A in top rolled history. He also gets three Terry influence. Stan decides to immediately spend these three Terry influences to draw the top three influence cards of the deck and choose one to draw. Looking at the three cards he drew, he decides to get caffeine pills and uh, buy it, which costs six integrity. Stan thus loses six points for buying this card. Stan has one action to take, and he takes it to relax, which reduces his stress by three. He now looks at his essay cards and realizes that since he has less than four integrity, he can flip plagiarized essay face up. This allows him to draw another essay and get two resume points. Essays that are not flipped face up by the end of the game are still worth points. Also, once an essay is flipped, it cannot be flipped again. It is now Pry's turn again. She plays the card Curriculum Knight. This lets her draw an influence card and has all players gain two stress. She draws Teacher's Favorite, but she doesn't want it so she puts it out for someone else to buy on their turn. Pry now has four actions and she decides to spend all four of them socializing to get eight friends. It is now Norm's turn. He plays the event Homecoming, which gives all players with fewer than 5 friends 4 stress. Norm just got to 10 stress. Whenever a player gets to 10 stress, they have a mental breakdown. 
set their stress back to zero, and reduce their happiness by three. Then give them a detention. Each detention is negative five resume points, and it is represented by a cube on the character profile picture. Norm now has two actions left. He spends both of these actions socializing for a total of four friends. It is now Stan's turn again. He chooses to play the flu and gives himself and Pry two stress. He now has three actions. Stan studies and gets one English stat. Then he test corrects English one to an A by spending his two English stats. This gives him one point and three Yas teacher influence. Stan decides to use Matthew's ability and Yas's ability to get two math stat and then get three science stat. He then has to remove two stats due to Yas's second ability and removes his two math stat. Stan now takes a second test corrections action to flip physics to an A by spending two of his science stat. This gives him one point for getting an A in physics and two points for perfect grades. He now gets three physics teacher influence. Stan decides to use physics's ability by spending two of his influence and reduces his stress by three. He also decides to buy teacher's favorite, which costs five happiness, but gives him ten teacher influence. He puts his ten teacher influence in physics and spends his ten influence to get the recommendation letter with physics. This is represented by putting a spare player pawn on the teacher. Other players can now not get the rec. Also, they cannot take the action chat with that teacher. Keep in mind that players cannot get more than two recommendation letters. The physics rec gives Stan four points. It is now Pry's turn. She plays Studgev Election. Studgev Election gives the player with the most friends the achievement card Studgev President. Pry has the most friends, so she gets this card. It gives her three points and makes it so that her clubs cost one less friend to purchase. However, at the start of each year, it's given to the player with the most friends. Because of the one friend discount, Pry can now buy football, which costs nine friends. Pry spends her eight friends to get three points and four Franklin teacher influence. She now has two actions. She spends these actions socializing and relaxing to reduce her stress by three and get two friends. It is now Norm's turn. He decides to skip his turn by discarding a card instead of playing it. This allows him to remove a detention, so now he regains the five points he lost. It is now Stan's turn. He plays crushing on someone and gets four actions. He spends two actions relaxing to reduce his stress by five. Then he chats twice with Novel and uses that ability immediately to get effectively to happiness. It's now Pry's turn again. She plays mandatory volunteering and gets eight teacher influence with Franklin. Because she already has a lot of Franklin influence, she decides to use the larger cubes. Each large cube is worth five of the smaller cubes. This way she can save space. It is now Norm's turn. Norm plays uh, make fun of someone and causes Stan to lose two happiness and gain two stress. Before taking his two actions, he decides to use Matthew's teacher ability. By spending three Matthew influence, he gets two math stats. Now he takes the test corrections action to get an A in algebra two. This gives him one point and three Matthew influence. Then he decides to socialize and gets two friends. All players are out of cards, so now it becomes sophomore year. However, before that, players take their end of year effects. Players can take end of year effects in any order that they choose. Stan has five happiness, so he's going to take a three stress penalty. Stan will take an additional three stress penalty for having caffeine pills. Finally, Stan will place four Fs on his sophomore classes. Pry also has to take end of year effects. She's going to get three stats for a private tutor. She puts these three stats in science. Then, she gets five friends but loses one stat. She chooses to lose an English stat. This is from the football end of year effect. Now, she places four Fs on her sophomore classes. Finally, Norm takes three stress from his low happiness penalty. He gets two math stat from math team and gets four new Fs on his sophomore classes. Now, the sophomore deck is swapped out for the freshman event deck. Players will get four sophomore event cards and draft these. The game continues until the end of senior year, where the player with the most resume points wins. One more thing to note, players can take the fun starting junior year. Also, don't forget that the winner of each game gets to write a senior quote on the back of the rulebook. Good luck, have fun, and hopefully you get into college.